caravan saw 13 small ships sailing across the sea. It was Matholoch, the king of Ireland, who was crossing the sea to ask for Bendigavran's permission to marry his beautiful sister, Branwen. Her hair was long and black as the night, and her lips were, were like red roses. All of the Irish men came into the magnificent court of Harlech, and a great feast was enjoyed. Fortunately, Branwen agreed to marry Macholoch, but unfortunately, there was one person who was very unhappy about this. He was a Phoenician, who was Branwen and Bendy Gavron's nasty half-brother. While everyone else was enjoying the wedding festivities, a Phoenician, who was very angry, cut off the ears, tails and jaws of Macholoch's beautiful white horses. Macholoch and his men were furious. Bendy Gaedfran hoped Macholoch would forgive Evnishen and gave him some new horses, gold jewellery and a magic cauldron. The magic cauldron was very special as it could give new life to a person who had died. The following morning, Matholoch, his men, and Branwen sailed back to Ireland. They lived happily there for one year and had a son called Gwen.